my goodness. What is your problem? Okay, all I said was I love you. Your reaction you is baloney. not normal. Awful. That looked awful. Mm. YouTube's gonna get mad at me for that one. <sighs> Food is, seems to be your biggest distraction <laughs> that makes you the easiest to scare. I don't even want it now. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Yes, I think. Go back. What you doing there? I'm gonna make an omelet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> You're you. I was just turning around. You were. <laughs> you saw me. Well, sometimes you're still really easy to scare. I could hear you come in and then I saw you in the mirror. Oh, that, was, that was pretty weird. I should have snuck more. Yeah. Andrea's, Andrea's having a moment, so I figured I'd, I should probably get this on video. <laughs> Not. <laughs> <laughs> we're out, we're, we're on our way home. It's my birthday today. Happy birthday! Yeah. And we went out to lunch and then we're taking a scenic route home. We stopped at this little like roadside state forest thingy. And it's, what is it, probably 45 or 50 degrees? Let me look. And I like, think it was in the 40s. It's damp and chilly, and she's just not having it. I'm not having it. It's 43. That's cold. Feels like 37, so there you go. That is chilly. I'm not dressed appropriate. <laughs> I'm, 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 you are inappropriate, I'm young like, lady. I'm done with the cold. I can't take it anymore. It physically hurts my Today's body. like the first day it's not been nice <laughs> in a couple <laughs> weeks. <laughs> so I know, we've been super so spoiled. I don't mean to complain. And I was trying not to like grumble about anything on your birthday, but yeah. I have like an instant headache because I can't help from doing this. Yeah. I just want to be warm. <laughs> we, we ate lunch at my favorite burger place and now we're taking a scenic drive. And we're gonna stop at this really weird Amish run, <laughs> like flea market store consignment shop thing. I don't know what it is, but we'll see if we can sneak in a hidden camera and uh, catch them in the wild. <laughs> <laughs> so let's do Stay it. Stay tuned. just fell off all of a sudden in the last couple days. It was, it was windy really too. Bad. That really takes them down. It does. Well, y'all, we were gonna have this cool video of the Amish store, but... No. That's sad. No, that's normal. But, I mean, I now that we're here, I'm glad we didn't come just for this, but... Thursdays, I think it's Tuesdays and Thursdays in November, they hold their weddings. Bummer. So I was going to make you take your picture with an Amish buggy. <laughs> She's really scared of horses. <laughs> I'm scared of all well, that livestock. We'll have to come here again. and Another time. Another time, another place. Bummer. It's yeah. my birthday, too. Hey. <laughs> we sound really <laughs> whiny today. Hey. We've got the a case of the Pennsylvania droop. Yeah, it's not good yeah, if we're starting out. Yeah, already. it goes from like November to April. So if you want to unsubscribe, we understand. We understand. <laughs> Come back in June. <laughs>
other crows, but there was a vulture. That's exciting. Yeah. We'll stop up here and get a little look of the whole valley. So this is the, the valley where we live. What do you think? Beautiful. What you doing there? Would you just look at it? Just look at it. Our house is right about there. Way over there. Somewhere up in there. A couple miles away. Pretty cool. <laughs> yep. I don't know what else to say. That's it. Catch you later. <laughs> this video is done. We're done. Sing us a song. <laughs> I don't want to. We're staying until you sing happy birthday twice happy at normal birthday. speed. I don't know. Sing, <laughs> sing us a song of a freezing girl. <laughs> You're getting way too close to me. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to see what you were seeing. Uh, same thing as I'm you. On top of the world, eh? So they put these rocks out here to. I was singing. Sorry, go ahead. No, I'm kidding. They put these rocks out here to detour people from driving off the cliff, and then people deface them with profanities and obscene things. And so they come up here and paint them. I don't know what they paint them with. It's like some shiny black stuff. But, uh, yeah, it's a shame because you can see people just litter. It seems to be, from my research, that Bud Light drinkers are the most prone to littering. What are you doing? I'm not done. I'm not, I'm not done here. I'm trying to do a nice video and she won't even stay out of the car. Young lady, you get back out here. You gonna make me stay out here by myself? All right. All right, so we have quite a story about this road. We are kind of out in the middle of nowhere and the road gets very steep. And uh, sorry, I'll stop here for a second. So tell them what we do up here. We used to do. Used to do. I can not I can barely handle telling this story, but we used to come here in the snowy weather and go sled riding because we don't have any hills at our house. And not a heavily traveled road, so it's a perfect place. Used to. We don't come anymore because a couple of years ago we came. I don't know how much snow there was, like six or it was eight pretty inches. Pretty good snow. And Saul went first, and you know you have to work at getting a path going. And he didn't go maybe I don't know ten feet or something. He was having a hard time. And Seth tried to really get the path going and. Time after time, he wasn't getting very far. The snow was so thick. And Scarlett couldn't wait till we got a good path. She wanted to go, so we let her. She's so little and light that she and stayed right on top. She was in one of those little saucers, like the round plastic right. dome thing. She took off. And at first it was kind of funny. We're like, whoa, Yeah. she's really going. She was like slowly rotating, screaming as she's going down the hill. And she wasn't going that fast. No, but, but she, as she got picked up momentum, yeah. well, there is a main road here. Yeah, and we'll show you. But it, So it goes down here and turns, but then there's another like 90 degree turn before you get to the paved road. So this is Scarlet, and she we thought she'll just go straight into the woods. The road curves. She didn't go straight. She curved. About that curve, my heart wanted to stop. Seth realized, oh boy. And we hear and see a truck coming on the main road. Just flying, like flying. 55. And she's getting nearer. And I'm watching the like, you know, kind of gauging ahead where they're going. Like, they, like, she's dead. They, she's gonna, and I'm running as fast as I can down the snow. Like, we saw my footprints later. They, and they were, were so far apart. I was just she running was as fast as I could, and her. I knew I couldn't. And I'm like, I'm gonna be right there when she goes splat. <sighs> and just well, somehow, God just I prayed. stopped I, her. I was screaming, bawling, praying, 
And she stopped. Like three feet shy of the road. Right. And right as the truck went. Right by like, her, never knew, never saw yeah, her. With, Wouldn't have been there at Because the tree line is like right on the edge of the road. So we'll oh. take you down and show you the road. So we don't usually come up this far. It's gonna straighten out here in a second. And we'll show you kind of the sled route. It's a great route. And the whole time, as an adult or an older kid, you know, if you start getting out of control, you just roll off your sled. Right. Because the snow's deep, you stop almost instantly. And we're like, I'm screaming at her, jump off. Jump off. But she's got like terrified white knuckle grip on yeah. the sled. And she was like, not. Yeah, not even thinking about letting go. And she didn't know she was about to get run over. Right. She was just scared because she was going backwards down exactly. a hill. Exactly. And, uh, and you know she don't. I think she was just blacked out. She didn't even see the truck no. go by because. And, and Saul didn't understand yeah. why I was so Mom upset. Mom was crying. So we started about right here. So you can see, uh, it's hard to tell on the camera, but this is really steep. Pretty steep. And straight, but it's not anything crazy. And then usually you go around this turn, and if you kind of slow down, it does flatten out. Or you just go straight into the little ditch here. We've done. But if you can see. Yeah. That's the main road here, up here. We're here. It's a picture of little girls screaming, spinning down the slot or the, in a sled. And, and we got, thought she'd go straight, yeah. and she didn't. And she you got curved. In the truck, just like we could see him, like right there by that mile per hour sign, and she stopped right, like just I don't know feet shy of getting to the road. Like, and the truck's like. Wow. So it was awful. It was awful. And we are so thankful that God protected her because I don't know how we'd go on without her. So So as your parent, you live and learn. Yeah, you do. And so we're hoping to help some other people. Don't sled ride when there's a major road. Or <laughs> if I had been down there, say I was carrying the sled and yeah. helping the kids. Because if I had stayed down there, I, she wasn't going that fast. You could have stopped could've her. Blocked her. But she got going and you couldn't catch up yeah, to her. And, and that was... I was really laughing. I was like, oh, that's At she first, and, yeah. And I let her get too far away. And... So anyway, this story has a happy ending. But uh, even to this day, the kids don't like going up that road. No. And Scarlett refuses to sled ride. And uh, yeah, so glad she's okay. Me too. Could have been a bad day. Yeah. The school bus just got here. And I had plans to uh, get here early. And... Uh, use the air horn to scare her but now we're out here i don't have time to go get it so i'm going to use the truck horn see if it works see if i can scare her hopefully if we don't move she won't see us look I, how sweet she is i just shut the truck off Sand. <laughs> what is that Ready? oh no <laughs> <laughs> she looked like she was like in pain or yeah, something. Yeah, in agony. <laughs> She's too cute. Well. She's always happy and waving to people. Uh, Every day she gets off the bus and turns to wave to all of her friends. Mm -hmm. she's, she's so joyful. And I said, Who are you waving to? She goes, I don't know. Aww. I don't think, I think there's only watching. a couple kids left on the bus and the driver, but. She's so sweetie. Well, I'll have to get the air horn out and try again. So glad she survived the near-death experience. Yes, she's still with us. Praise the Lord. Maybe I'll try to get Saul on the way home, too. Good idea. All right, stay tuned. More to come. It's tradition in our family. Whoever's birthday it is, you ask them what they want to eat and what you want for dessert. And my mom does it, too, so I get two yummy meals. So this is my dessert choice for this year. Oh yes, tell them what it is. Candy cake. It's a layer of uh, kind of a dense vanilla cake. A layer of peanut butter and then chocolate. And the chocolate. Hardens. It gets real hard. I like this cold. And it's it's kind of like those tasty cakes. Yeah. Are they called candy cakes? I think they can be. <laughs> but those are good. Very good. What else is on the menu? Later tonight, we're going to have sausage dip and veggie pizza. Yummy. Yeah. We'll be so full. Yes, we will.
We've eaten a lot already today. We're, we're big into snacks. I made sticky buns this morning. We yeah. didn't video that. Are they still in there? Oh, yeah. They're just stuck. Sticky buns, and then that's the base for our veggie pizza later, which I think we made last year on my birthday. Okay. It's in one of the we videos. Like yeah. Can't wait. I haven't scared you with an air horn in a long time. <laughs> Does that make you mad? No, I don't know, like... <laughs> One of your fans got your me own... this. Yeah, and he didn't send it to you to use against me. Well, Give it to me. what do you expect? No, because you can do it I in my face. I was supposed to scare you. <laughs> my ear's ringing. Hand it over. It's a loud one, isn't it? Oh. Woo! I don't even want to do ah. it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was loud. You don't have to shake them. It's not a can of spray paint. Oh. All right. Mm. I just can feel my body. Yeah. Shh, shh, shh. Love you. Love you. Psh. You started it. So this is not our favorite time of year, is it? What you're doing? I am cleaning up and dividing in two birds. These are canna lilies. They are the real big, tall, leafy, kind of tropical. It's real leafy, and then it gets like a red um, flower on the top at the end of summer. So I planted about, I think about 15, and they multiply. So now I have like. Uh, maybe 150. I don't know. You got more than that. I didn't count, but there's a lot there. Look how big some of these are. They're huge. I can I can divide that more. I'm just kind of doing the bare minimum right now. Just trying to get get it done. It's gonna freeze tonight, so they would not survive. So you're kind of shaking the dirt off of them. Yep, just kind of breaking it off, and then. All these long roots can just be snipped. You don't need them. Looks fun. It's a blast. I helped. I helped to uh, dig them. Dig them up. I'm the shovel guy. Let's do the hard work. I think that's the easy work because, I mean, I was done before you, obviously. Well, this is tedious, I guess, but I can't really shovel. You can't do the muscle, but... I can't. You sure are good with your TDs. <laughs> I was trying to think of Excuse abbreviation for, what? for tedious. Your teeds. Uh, I don't think that's appropriate. <laughs> this doesn't sound quite right. Tittles? Nope. <laughs> nope. Your monotonous jobs. Yeah. All right. Carry on. Thanks. Under the Boo. bed of your trap. <laughs> it's me. It wasn't like a real bad scare till I saw you. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I'm like, ah! At first, I thought you were just gonna be like, hi, and then you. No, I thought that was the dog. It was a huge delay. It's not the doggy. Sit down. Sit. Say she's not scary. Ha, ha, ha.